Hello my lovely, so this is Lizzie from Love From Lizzie and today I'm bringing you the November 2022 release video which is to go along with the Cozy Christmas card kit that we have just released. Uh, I'm not going to run through this here now um, but the unboxing is live so if you've not seen it I suggest you jump out of this video, head back to the previous one, have a watch of that and then this will all make sense. But this is the Cozy Christmas kit um, that we have just released, it's available now. Um, and I wanted to run through some bits and pieces that we had to work alongside with that kit. We will be taking add-on orders up to and including the 27th of October until 9am Greenwich Mean Time um, because that's when we will do our final print and then we'll be packing to make sure everything's ready to be able to start shipping from the 1st of November which lands on a weekday which is fabulous for us. Um, and then they will all be out on their way to you. Um, if you're not a subscriber, obviously you can subscribe, this will be your first kit. Um, and once you've subscribed, you don't pay any additional shipping for any further orders that you make. We just collect them up throughout the month. And then when it comes to time to send your kits, all of your orders get put in there and they get shipped off to you. So it's like Christmas once a month anyway. Right, so I'm gonna run through what we've got as add-ons now. Please excuse my sample size bag of sequins here. It will be a full size bag that you'd receive if you buy it as an add-on, but I didn't have one on hand. But it's these lovely holographic in green, red and gold in different sizes and the cups and some tiny weeny little flat ones as well. So really, really nice and shiny to add some sparkle into your um, card making there. We have got a pearlescent bundle, the cozy Christmas bundle. There are five sheets this month. Um, there is the red, a nice soft blue and pink, a brown and a gold. And these work really well with the dyes that come in the kit. Um, and the pattern papers as well, because there is a lot of pastels as well as the traditional colors. So we wanted to put something together that would work really nicely there. We have got the peel off bundles. And there are two as always. So we have the variety bundle, cozy Christmas variety, which is gold moonstone stars. Then we have brown mirror straight. We have mint moon dust in pin, and we have white with gold overlay in straight. So that's the variety bundle this month. The pin bundle is all with gold overlay. So I'm holding this at an angle so that you're not blinded by it, but it's racing car green with gold overlay, mink with gold overlay, brown with gold overlay, and ruby red with gold overlay, and that's brand new. So. They are our peel off bundles and we have got some really lovely dyes this month as well. I'm going to start with the nutcrackers. These are so cute. Um, I have die cut them out so that you can see how they all look, but there are three dies in this set. And they are super, super cute. Really grumpy looking nutcrackers, exactly as nutcrackers are supposed to look. And these are great for paper piecing. So die cut out one, put some tape over the back and then just pop in the little bits. You've got the drumsticks with this chap. He's holding a Christmas tree. And this one's just standing very sturdy like a soldier. But um, I absolutely adore nutcrackers. Um, we always used to have them when I was little in, uh, in the house. They all always came out and I read the story one too many times as a child and I was expecting it to come to life, I think. <laughs> um, but so we have nutcrackers, we have this ever so cute snowman. This is a really lovely panel die. So if you're making repeat holiday cards, um, something like this makes that ever so simple. I mean, I've done all of these in gold mirror. Um, however, personally, if I made this, I think I would probably use a silver mirror. But um, again, you can paper piece in the scarf or even once that's stuck down, you could even use like the, I really like the jelly roll pens in between um, die cut things. So to colour in the holly on his hat, there's a really nice little snowflake there that you could put a bit of Wink of Stella over, the snow. But yeah, really, really lovely. One die that will um, be really effective, or even with just a bit of ribbon around it and a nice sentiment, I think that would make for a really lovely holiday card. This is a lovely one. If you like a square card, um, there's two dies in this set and I used both to cut that out. Now I am going to put something 
white behind it just to make it pop but it is walking in a winter wonderland surrounded by lovely swells and snowflakes um, so so pretty and the really nice thing about this die is you can die cut merely the inlay so pretend there isn't an outer edge so if you wanted to die cut this put some acetate behind it you've got a really lovely big shaker and the size will just keep going until you want to trim it down or you can use the outer square as well which is what I've done here to um, to frame it up so walking in a winter wonderland and we also have absolutely stunning angel um, angel with star so let's get her out so this is her die cut she's so pretty and got a little smiley face again perfect for paper piecing and this was obviously a happy accident but as I was popping out all the little bits there's some really pretty sprigs that come out of her wings so they could be saved and used for something else um, you have the very pretty star of Bethlehem there so there's two dies but you, you got bonus little bonus little pieces um, so we have those and we also have Hello Winter stamp set which is a smaller stamp set four by four inches hello winter we wish you a merry christmas happy winter season it's the most wonderful time of the year and then there's lots of little hearts and these little hearts stamp really nicely like in amongst the spaces in the letters and there's also a little spray of three so you could just create some hearts at christmas time um, we are doing a if stamp and ephemera bundle the winter wishes bundle um, so it's the add-on stamp set which is let it snow and it's the most wonderful time of the year with the igloo and the little snow fox the owl holly jolly and then there's another bird with some earmuffs and a polar bear wearing a jumper and a little christmas tree and then there is the ephemera that that goes along with we do have lots of other collections but we've bundled this together at a really nice price to make it uh, worthwhile if you're wanting to add some bits in we have got the lime green peel offs which featured last month in the kit they're in pinstripe so you get three different widths on there they are now available for individual purchase we have the autumn friends stamp set so this was from last month's kit if you didn't manage to get it there are some wreaths and the sentiments all fit within and then a few swirly sprigs and a pumpkin with some leaves and we have the enchanted lake uh, bundle which we put together so this is some of the um, embellishment pieces um, from it we had a kit oh gosh two years two years ago um, and there's decoupage stickers ephemera that's just not been popped out ultimately and these are sort of banners that you can hang across and they you untie that and you can use the thread or you can just lace them yourself and here are some little topper pieces um, and they've all got a little bit of glitter on them but you've got these lovely christmas wishes swan a little bauble and winter wishes there so that's all together and they are in the lizzie's specials we also have something that we haven't done before and uh, the santoro gorgeous christmas card kit this makes 24 cards um, it comes in a lovely box which if you opened up you could actually use this card as well um, and I'm just going to pop out all the bits that are in there and quickly run you through it so nearly so inside the box you have a pack of gold foiled little round stickers ivory envelopes in small ivory envelopes in large small card bases in four different designs and then larger card bases in the four different designs 
and then you have decoupage and toppers here um, and they're all labelled up so they're easy to build up and melt together and there are some really pretty ones some of them are just with gifts others are more traditional with the Christmas trees I love this little girl with the hat she's so sweet I mean you have lots of sentiments there to be able to personalise and customise and then these really cute ones with the polar bear and with the penguins and then you have the angel and again the girl with a tree and then just and that could be used for any time of the year to be honest but that is the Santoro Christmas kit and that is ready as well so those are all of our new products that's everything that we've got that's brand new to the shop and I'm going to run through a few previous bits um, that we have so that you can else we have and it's all under the Christmas tab so um, if you go to the shop in the top banner there is Christmas and everything there is listed so if I'm a little bit quick then um, you'll be able to see things there but we have the Hello Santa which was last year's Christmas collections and lots of different bits and pieces I'm trying to be somewhat organised with how I show this we have winter wonderland um these are stickers and then these felt snowflakes which are super cute we have lots of enchanted lake bits and pieces still so we have the decoupage stickers tags ephemera and this is the paper pack which was ever so popular we have lots of lovely christmas dies these are the intricate uh, sentiment dies you have the door wreath the bauble the star of bethlehem we have the embossing folder, we have the silent night stamp set, we have the merry little Christmas stamp set which I really enjoyed, that was part of a um, mega pack, we have the O oh Santa stamp set which was um, in last year's kit but I think this is quite possibly one of my most favourite sentiments, the merry Christmas in that, the way that hand lettering is done, but it's all fun and games until Santa checks the naughty list. We wish you a Merry Christmas, Seasons Greetings, Merry and Bright, and then a few little icons. I mean, these little mittens would work wonderfully with this current kit. Um, we have the Hello Winter, and this is a, a never-ending stamp. So you can stamp it and stamp it and stamp it, and it just keeps going. And the same goes for the border stamp as well. Um, we have this lovely Joy to the World, Jingle All the Way, and Merry Christmas mini set. We have Merry and Bright. This was, I believe, my second Christmas kit. And it's like wood grain um, shapes with lots of nice, very simple and some really diddy sentiments there. We have the Let It Snow die, which I think was one of my most popular dies previously. And I've managed to get more stock available. We have the Acetate sentiments and they're like Joy, Noel, Christmas. We have the Warm Winter Wishes stamp set. Um, I did show you the bundle which had the other stamp set from the same collection. They are there too. And the Warm Winter Wishes ephemera and ribbons. We also have a handful of the Warm Winter Wishes kit. Now I'm not going to pull it all out because there are pictures in the shop. However, this what you know this is a kit and we often sell out of our kits and this one we are able to release a few more back in. So you've got pattern papers, ephemera, peel-offs, enamel dots, ribbons, acetate dies, wooden pieces. So it's a full kit and we don't often um, have any extras to re-release. We of course have our favourite, my favourite, the Magic of Christmas pad, which has stickers, acetates, vellum, um, mirror board it has everything all in there so that you can actually make cards as long as you've got some card bases and some glue and of course I always recommend a peel off or two but you can um, definitely make a nice selection of cards from this because there is two sticker sheets with all the lovely little angels um, on there gosh I'm making a real mess here sorry this is not pleasing to look at um, we have lots of Christmas patterned papers and I need to, um, I've had very strict instructions from Sue about this. So we have all of our Christmas peel-off bundles back in stock. They are there. 
and they go out super super quick and we replenish them just as quick as we can but they are all in stock and we have last year's kit as well there are a few of these left so this was O Santa which has the stamps the dies really nice sequin mix ribbon bows um, vellum cardstock A4 patterned papers and decoupage pieces to pop together some die cut tags and stickers that loads in there and there is all of the associated add-ons that go with that so there is the bumper pack which is enormous uh, and that is full of die cuts you have stickers chipboard tags sentiments to pop out and stickers and it, all this lovely really super cute and it all has this iridescent glitter over the top so that is me running through all of it <laughs> Thank you ever so much for sticking with me till the end on that, if you're still here. Um, I will pop some still shots in now. And as I say, if you're wanting to have a look at anything, I would strongly recommend just click on the Christmas tab. It's there all year round. Um, Sue has put a couple of bits into the Lizzie specials if you're wanting to have a look to see if there's a little deal that you wanted to get hold of. But you can have this obviously added into your boxes if you are subscribed up to and including the 27th of October, which is next Thursday morning. Um, thank you ever so much. And the design team kits are winging their way out to them. So there will be videos coming shortly. I will always, as always, will be trying to make. I actually made with last month's kit and I just need to do my voiceover and then I'll pop that in. But thank you ever so much. And until next time, happy paper crafting. Bye.